Industrial Timber and Lumber Company is one of the largest producers of hardwood lumber in the United States. ITL produces and sells over 150 million board feet of grade hardwood lumber annually. Located in the heart of northern Appalachia, ITL owns over 35,000 acres of premium timberland and has six production facilities strategically located in North Carolina, West Virginia, Ohio, and Pennsylvania to provide its customers with a wide variety of the finest hardwoods available. Our 35,000 acres of premium timber is located in the Allegheny National Forest region, which is renowned for producing the finest cherry in the world. In addition to cherry, this unique growing area produces other fine species such as hard and soft maple, red and white oak. ITL's Southeast Ohio location is known for being located in America's finest white oak region. ITL understands and adheres to the principles of best management practices to ensure its timber is harvested in a sustainable manner for future generations to enjoy. ITL is currently FSC certified at two of its locations. Our process begins with our staff of graduate professional foresters. These highly trained individuals survey the land and select those trees that need managed to allow them to mature into the finest specimens of their species. Many factors are considered to promote optimal growing conditions to encourage seed regeneration for the future of the forest. Mature trees and trees that are negatively impacting the selected areas are marked for harvest. Removing the selected trees opens the forest canopy to allow increased sunlight and promote the growth of seedlings. Prior to removing any trees, a harvesting plan is prepared by our professional foresters and is reviewed in detail with the logging crew. This harvesting plan includes provisions to avoid erosion, water and stream contamination, logging hazards and safety that ensures the wildlife habitat is preserved. The highly experienced logging crew carefully removes trees identified for harvest so as not to damage the surrounding trees. The logging process continues whereby the felled tree is removed from the harvest area and skidded to a landing area where the logs are then transported to one of ITL's sawmills for processing. Consistent with all aspects of ITL's operations, special emphasis is given to safety. Safety is ITL's number one priority. ITL is proud of its safety and health promotion programs and has partnered with OSHA by submitting to its voluntary annual inspections program at each of its six manufacturing facilities. ITL is proud that it was the first lumber company to be awarded OSHA's Sharps certification in North Carolina, West Virginia and Pennsylvania. Upon arriving at the sawmill, all logs are carefully inspected, measured, and graded. After identifying the species, the correct footage is determined by using the Doyle log scale. The United States Department of Forestry's grading rules are uniformly applied. All logs are individually identified with barcode tags and entered into inventory. Species are separated into rows and rotated by sawing rows according to the date they arrived at the sawmill. Discipline management is required to keep the logs fresh and free from stain year-round. The sawmilling process starts at the debarker, which will remove the bark, mud, rocks, and any other items that may dull the saw blade. From there, each log is passed through a metal detector. This is done to ensure the logs going into the sawmill are clean and metal free. Once inside the mill, the logs are sawn into their highest value lumber. This is accomplished by using a computer optimization technology to first scan the log 
and position the log to the saw blade to fully maximize all usable lumber. ITL uses the latest state-of-the-art technology to produce the finest lumber and maximize the grade and volume of the use. Band saws, maintained by our own professional saw filers, are used to reduce the amount of sawdust between cuts. Optimization scanners are used for minimizing the waste at the head saw and maximizing the volume at the edger. Nature provides us with a renewable resource that requires a human lifetime to produce. ITL respects the resources and understands the importance of utilizing to its fullest extent every log sod. Nothing is left for waste. The bark is sold for landscape mulch, chips produced from the slabs are sold to both paper and particle board mills, and the sawdust is used to fuel the boiler, which is used to dry the lumber. After sawing, every board is inspected by highly trained lumber inspectors using the established by the National Hardwood Lumber Association. As a benefit, ITL inspectors use proprietary grading rules which further enhance the value of the lumber by taking into account such factors as color and defect placement that are not considered using the standard grading procedures. Following grading, the lumber is precision double end trim and separated by thickness and length. It is then stacked on fluted sticks using one foot centers to promote flat and straight lumber. Every package is individually tagged and identified for accurate inventory control and end wax to prevent splitting. Special attention is taken to avoid staining and discoloring lumber. The lumber is transported to one of three areas for further preparation prior to kiln drying. Fan shed technology is used to keep all white woods bright and white and pre-dryers are used to prevent stain and checking of oak lumber. Air drying is used for cherry, utilizing concrete covers to provide added weight and prevent warpage. The kiln drying process begins with the skill of the kiln operator. The operator's skills are enhanced by the quality of the kiln drying equipment available. ITL uses state-of-the-art kilns with variable speed fans and computer controllers. Every species is unique in the way it dries. Oak lumber requires low air speed and high humidity whereas maple lumber requires high velocity and lower humidity. Kiln temperatures of up to 160 degrees are required to remove cellular water from the lumber's core. Years of experience is required to understand how to consistently dry every board correctly. Depending on both the thickness and the species, hardwood lumber requires up to six months to fully dry. Even though computer technology is available to the operator, ITL still requires that samples be visually monitored and manually weighed daily until the moisture content is between 6 and 8 percent. All lumber is equalized to ensure uniform moisture content between all boards and is stress relieved to eliminate saw pinching and straightness for ripping. When the lumber is removed from the kiln, it is stored under cover for cooling before the reinspection process begins. Every kiln dried board is regraded after drying. This process is necessary because the shrinkage and stress that occurs during the drying process can change the grade classification. All lumber is accurately graded and length separated in precision packaging. Custom packaging is made available depending upon the use, destination, or customer specification. Steel or plastic strapping IPPC identified heat treated runners meet ISPM 15 requirements. End painting and cardboard covers are made available. Accurate tallies are provided for every bundle of lumber produced. After safety, quality control is ITL's next most important priority. Written quality standards are monitored daily at every ITL location to ensure consistency between packages and loads. ITL takes great pride and practices daily the art of listening to its customers. ITL sales representatives are experienced lumber persons who listen and learn from our customers and communicate their needs to manufacturing personnel. This relationship between customer, salesperson, and production has made ITL a leader and an innovator in the hardwood industry and made possible ITL's variety of grade and species, vast available inventory, value-added services, and the ability to ship accurately and on time. ITL's written grade specifications exceed the requirements of the NHLA. Reduced wain and location of defects provides customers with higher yielding product. Special attention to factors other than standard defects has made ITL an innovator. For example, ITL was the first hardwood producer to offer color-sorted red oak.
Because of ITL's locations, it produces species from ash to walnut. ITL's vast, readily available inventory offers customers access to this variety of species, grades, and thicknesses. In addition, ITL regularly stocks West Coast hardwoods, eastern pine, cedar, and some imported species. ITL facilities have added value capabilities and machinery necessary to accurately sort, surface, and rip to individual customer specifications. Order coordinators provide a necessary link between sales and production to facilitate scheduling to ensure on-time and accurate shipment. ITL's logistics experience coordinators have compiled an extensive network of transportation contractors so lumber can be shipped by truck, rail, container, or by ship. ITL supplies lumber to both domestic and export customers. ITL has satisfied customers located in all 50 states, Canada and Mexico and to over 50 countries worldwide for over 30 years. ITL has access to all Eastern U.S. ports and can provide documentation necessary regardless of the destination. ITL's experienced export department has over 100 years of combined export experience. ITL's international representatives not only understand the product they sell, but also speak the languages and understand the cultures of their territories. No matter where you are located or what your lumber requirements are, ITL has the timber resources, the investment in production facilities and equipment, and the personal expertise to provide the best hardwood solutions possible. Whether it is a one item order or an order with multiple items, you can be assured that your order will be accurate and arrive on time. Call 1-800-829-WOOD or visit us on the web at itlcorp.com to make ITL your product to market partner.